Here is an explanation for the answer to final exam, question number four, found on page 662 of Teach Yourself Electricity and Electronics, edition number five. The question asks us, how is a pure inductive reactance represented in impedance terms or in the complex number system? Here is the resistance reactance half plane. Resistance having only positive values goes off along that axis, and reactance is the imaginary number vertical axis. When we talk about pure inductive reactances, we talk about values that go straight up along the positive imaginary axis like that. That is inductive reactance, sometimes symbolized X sub L. Pure inductive reactances go up that way. If we have a combination of resistance and inductive reactance, we'll end up with a point somewhere in this upper right hand part of the half plane and we can represent that by a vector running from the origin out to that point. But the correct answer to this particular question is B, as in Bravo.